So as you know, Dakota Access will start at Williston and go all the way down to Illinois. And then the Midland Pipeline will connect to Williston to the Dakota Access Pipeline from the tar sands. And as you know, the whole idea is to push tar sands through, flush the pipes with water, and then push the sweet crude through, then flush the pipes with water. I keep on saying, where are they getting this water? Second, once the water is flushed too, the water is no good for anything or anybody. The water is then poisoned. I don't think people understand. Do you have anybody in your family who's dying of cancer? That's the first thing I ask people. Why? Because the water is poisoned. So when, when you look at the whole scheme of everything, you have these great roots that come out of a tree, and then you have this giant tree, and then you have these big branches that come out of the tree. That is the river. So right now the roots are dying in the Gulf of Mexico. The mother tree, the Mississippi, is dying. And so we have this branch that comes out of the Mississippi called the Missouri. It is sick, but if we can save it, it can bring life to the whole tree and reconstitute the roots and make life again. I don't understand why people don't understand that. As Native people, we go four days without food and water to remind ourselves how important water is. Because remember, our bodies are mostly water. And without water, we die. So why would anybody want their children to die? I cannot understand that whole compensation. So this pipeline will go under the meet the Missouri River. When it breaks, because it will break, it'll pollute all the way down the Missouri into the Mississippi, all the way to the Gulf. Who has a right to kill that many people? Oh wait, who has a right to kill that much wildlife, animals, plants, medicines? I just don't even think that people understand the whole concept of it all. So it's very thoughtful. And, uh, is any last thing you want to say? We got to stand for water. We got to continue to stand for water. Wherever you are, stand up for your water.